Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. It's Miranda and I am Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan and I am here with a plan with me in my B610. Before we get started, a few things. Make sure that if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Comment below if you're currently using a traveler's notebook and tell me what's your favorite part about planning in your TN. And then last but not least, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, I would absolutely love to have you here. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and the notification bell right next to it so that you will be informed anytime I upload new content. All right, jumping right in. We're going to go to last week to remind you of what our last week in January looked like. And I do have to do my February plan with me. Um, and just as a reminder, I'm using this as a, I'm using this as my one word journal. So this was the last week of um, January and we used the kit by Bella Digital Designs. This week, I'm trying another format. You guys know I will be trying out various ones just to see what actually works for me because like right now, I don't know what that looks like. So I'm just going to keep trying until I get it right. And this is one that I used before just to test out some weeks when I first started. All right, so for this week, I am going to be using a beautiful kit from Sarah Elizabeth Prince. I love her kits. They are maze balls. And so I encourage you to visit her shop. She's very reasonable. The colors are very vibrant. And yes, this is the first time that I'm using it in one of my tea or using it in my TN. Now I pulled out some washi tape. I don't know which ones I'm going to use, but this is called the Kate Mini Kit. And I believe that is um, it's inspired by Kate Spade is really what it reminds me of. All right, so I'm gonna start by putting down my glitter headers and they're on these pages. I started stapling my kits together so I could keep everything just the way that I wanted them. And I'm just gonna go in the order that she has them on the page and I am just going to turn the book upside down because as we know, I'm challenged when it comes to laying stickers straight. So, y'all, I just love planning in this TN. Like I could totally see myself next year using a TN as my on the go purse planner. Like I can feel it. Like I, I think it's coming. I'm not saying a hundred percent, but I think that's what I'm gonna go with. I because I really want to keep the variety on my channel. Um nothing's wrong with my current happy planner mini, but I think that I, I'm liking printing kits. Um this particular kit I bought and I just like the way it looks and decorating is so cute, it's so pretty, and I just love it. So um, what I thought I would do with this kit because or this particular layout, as things are laid out, you'll see there are meal plans here, here's some graph paper, here's habit trackers, to-do lists, and I, that's just not going to be the capacity in which I use this planner. So based on that, I am going to um, just, this will be one whole day, this will be a day, this will be a day. And, and, and actually doing that will afford me a little bit more room to actually um, plan, or not plan, a little more journaling space um, on my one words. Because I'll tell you, um, last week I was, I wanted to expound a little bit more, get a little deeper you know, as I'm doing this in conjunction with my self-discovery planner, it just really um, will help. Okay, so that is so totally crooked. And, you know, we got to bring this up. Come on, boo. Let me get my, I don't want to break out undo on my cute little glitter headers. But I don't discriminate. I will. If I have to bring out the undo, I got to bring out the undo. I'm going to have to bring out the undo. Where is it? When I tell y'all my desk is a mess, come on. Oh. Okay. I don't want to tear up my book, but I am. 
Okay, guys, I just totally ripped that sticker off. That's crazy. Okay. So I learned that these are not matte removable stickers, but it's okay. All right. I'm leaving it upside down because next I'm going to move forward with, I think there's some date covers on here maybe. Yes, here are the date covers. So this is Friday. So we're going to And this is Saturday. And Sunday. I should make the Sunday right here just to give me a little bit more room. Oh, did I just put that down crooked? Please go. Oh. Mm, I'm gonna have to get my undo. I'm really gonna have to get it because this these stickers do not come up. No, oh. I gotta get my undo. Not playing these reindeer games with these stickers. I will threaten them. I will threaten their very existence. I'm trying to figure out what how what's the best way to um okay yes that's beautiful how that came up all right this is actually sunday right here but it's like i'm leaving all that room for sunday so that's the part that i wasn't quite sure about where if i could perhaps split this box up and make it a little bit more I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna start Sunday here. And move this here. Okay. We just gotta make it make sense. And we're not about to lose no more glitter headers and we're not about to tear up no more okay no more parts of this planner this is getting ready to have to come right on back up okay now so i'm gonna set this here and we are going to continue to we're going to continue to Put our date covers on so so one good thing about this mini kit is that it really can go as far as you need it to go. So I think last week, I don't know. I, let's put the washi down. Let's put the washi strips down. All right, so I don't know which one is considered the long side and which one's considered the short side. But it looks like when I put this, here, this fits perfectly. All right. Probably could have whited it out, but it's okay. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. And I'm going to start this actually down and over here. And then we'll just cut off the excess. Let's just move you. Okay. I think that is so cute. Okay. So we're gonna put this 
down and I think I'm gonna have to move this Sunday up based on this placement, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. And then now, because it doesn't really have a whole lot of half boxes and things, it only has one, two, three, four half boxes. So it has some quarter boxes. It does have a habit tracker, something that I like to track, but I don't like the light pink part of it. So we'll see. One, two, three, four. Hmm. So I'm just gonna start laying stuff. I think I wanna use this black and white. I either thought the, the black and white striped or maybe the black and white polka dot, which I'm swaying towards the black and white polka dot. Okay. Let's see how the black and white polka dot looks. Cause I think it'll be pretty. That black and white polka dot I think is, and with the gold accents, I think it will be cute. now that we have gone in and finished decorating now we're going to come through and we're going to put our um, our words and here on the week I'm going to put the words here leaving these boxes for additional commentary if I feel uh, so inclined to add more commentary so the first word is new the second word is yes i like that word yes the next word is path the next word is horizon friday's word is mountain Saturday's word is river. And Sunday's word is open. And here I'm just gonna put journal. And I'm gonna put Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for our little habit tracker there. Well guys, this is, um, this completes my plan with me in my one word TN. And I think Tuesdays are going to be TN Tuesdays. I know I'm getting the video up a little bit late tonight, but still made the Tuesday date and still delivered on my promise to give you at least one video for every day of the week. Well, guys, if you enjoyed this plan with me, don't forget to give me the thumbs up, comment below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I hope you have a great and productive week. Ciao, Bella.